What's up, guys? SC Ambition. We're back here playing The Walking Dead Season 2, Episode 1. This is Part 4 of the walkthrough slash let's play. Last time I snuck into the house and, you know, got all the supplies I needed to stitch up my arm and did it, and then I fucked up that one zombie, and then those guys found out that I snuck in. So let's get going. This might hurt a little. Ow. How she look? Her suturing skills need some work, but otherwise, I say she should be fine. So, it wasn't a lurker bite? If it was, the fever would have already set in, and her temperature would be through the roof. I wish you wouldn't have done what you did. What do you mean? You manipulated my daughter. I asked for her help. She's not someone you can just ask for help. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. But there are a few things you need to know about my daughter. Okay. She isn't like you. You may not get that initially. But once you're around her for a while, you'll understand. She knew how bad the world is, what it's really like out there. She would cease to function. She's my little girl. She's all I have left, and I would ask that you stay away from her. I'm sorry. I didn't know. It's okay. You're forgiven. Just don't make any more mistakes. Hey, uh, brought you some food if you're hungry. That's gonna leave one hell of a car. It doesn't bother me. I can live with it. Wow. Nice. Hey, look. I just want to say I'm sorry for well, for being a dick out there. I got kind of aggro, and that was definitely not cool. Nick's been known to go off every once in a while. Don't hold it against him. Yeah, I guess we all have our moments. You definitely had one out there. I pressed X. What, what the fuck? Look, he means well. He just loses it sometimes. I try to avoid crazy people as much as possible. So, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? Maybe I could stay here for a little bit, if that's all right. I've got no problem with it. Do you think everyone else will be okay with it? Well, they'll just have to deal. Besides, it makes sense to let you heal and take some time to sort things out, at least for a little while. So... What happened to your parents, if you don't mind me asking? I mean, I assume what happened to them is what happened to just about everyone's parents. You're just so young. Didn't think you could have made it on your own for so long, but maybe you did. Other people took care of me, if that's what you're asking. I was just curious on how you made it this far. I just tried to stay with good people and not do anything dumb. I'm sorry. I... 
I shouldn't have asked. My parents went on vacation and left me with a babysitter. And they never came back. We went to Savannah to find them, but they were already dead. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. This man found me and took care of me. We met up with other survivors and we all tried to make it, but it didn't work. His name was Lee. He taught me how to survive. He taught me how to shoot a gun. What uh, happened to him? The same thing that happens to everyone. But he saved me first. Lots of times. Well, it sounds like he was a real good guy. Yeah. He was. I hate to interrupt, but I'm out there standing watch and I can't help but notice this place is lit up like a goddamn beacon in the middle of the woods. Yeah, it's time to turn in anyways. Well, get your winks while you can, because we're going fishing at first light. A couple fresh brookies for dinner? Mmm, wouldn't that be nice? You're still here. I wouldn't get comfortable if I were you. Maybe you fooled everyone else, but not me. What? Who? Don't pull that shit on me. I'm not my husband. What? I'm sorry. I don't understand. Yes, you do. I just needed some help. Well, you got it. Now go. Whose baby is it? Excuse me? If it's not Alvin's, whose is it? You shut your fucking mouth. <laughs> I got her. You should probably think about being nicer to me. That's just my advice. <laughs> Dude, I'm wrecking her right now. I knew you were going to be a fucking problem. I am fucking ending her life right now. Get shit on whatever her name is, but you're a bitch. You should probably think about being nicer to me. <laughs> Hell yeah, Clementine. Let's fucking get him. Let's fucking get him, Clementine. Yeah! Is that the end? I don't know. It's not loading. Here it is. Headed out. <clears throat> How you holding up? I heard you got an earful from Rebecca last night. Once she gets going, there's no bringing her back. Her bark's worse than her. She's mean. I don't like her. She did come on a little strong. How far are these fish traps? It ain't much further. Anyone teach you how to shoot? By that I mean taught proper. Any idiot with a finger can shoot. Yeah, but not a rifle. Well, that makes sense. Less kick. This thing would probably knock you on your ass. Nick was about your age, first time I took him hunting. Came across this beautiful 13-point buck just standing there on the ridge line. The boy takes the rifle, he lines up the shot just like I taught him, and... Then I hear him start whining. He turns to me and he says, I can't do it. I can't shoot it, Uncle Pete. Please don't make me shoot it. Oh, that's sad. 
Hey! Why didn't you wait? You want us standing around while you piss on a tree? You know where the river is, boy. Anyway, so I grab the gun out of his hand before the big buck runs off, when bang, the gun fires. Boy nearly gut shot me. And of course, the buck gets away. What are you going and telling her this shit for? Cause you almost blew her face off yesterday. Seems relevant. Trying to let her know it's nothing personal with you. Why are you always giving me a hard time? Because you're always giving everyone else a hard time. I tried to apologize already. She ain't having it. Well, can you blame her? I want to hear the rest of the story. You're always trying to embarrass me. You're doing a good enough job of that on your own. Leave <laughs> us again. I know where the fucking river is. Ooh, got him. So anyway, I found that buck later that season. Shot it right in the neck. Brought it up to my sister's figuring she'd want to freeze some of the meat. Nick didn't speak to me for weeks. Sometimes you gotta play a role. Even if it means people you love hate you for it. He doesn't hate you. Nick's father wasn't there much. And he was a piece of shit when he was. So it fell to me to keep him in line. Raise him right. Meant I couldn't just be nice Uncle Pete. Uncle Pete! Oh, oh yeah, I was about to say, is Nick. he uncle, brother, grandpa, or what? Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Ah, full of holes. Who do you think did this? Not sure yet, but it ain't your average gang of thugs, that much I know. Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? Check those guys there. Be careful. Some of them might still be moving. Who's Harver, or whatever? This one's shot too. Through the head? Yeah. Check the rest. And look for ammo. We're running low. There are more out there. This wasn't no rinky dink pissing match. What was it then? Fubar. Where are you going? We need to get the fuck out of here. Gotta check the rest. What? Why? Calm down and think about it, son. Calm down? We gotta get out of here now! Jesus Christ, get a hold of yourself! What if someone's alive, Nick? Who cares? Cause they might just be inclined to tell us who did this. We gotta do this now. He better not Stay get here. shot right now. Keep searching these. This is a dumb oh, idea. I thought it zoomed it on his face. I no, thought he was about Nick, to get his like brain blown out. But sooner or later, you're gonna have to realize a simple truth. What, that you're an asshole? That nobody in this world is ever gonna give a goddamn whether you like something or not. You gotta grow up, son. Whatever. Come on, Clem. You wanna be useful? Keep a lookout on that tree line. Whoever did this might still be out there, waiting for another sucker to stumble across this mess. Just like baiting a fish. I'd be more useful with a gun. I don't doubt it. At some point, you guys have to trust me. Hell, I trust you. But not everyone's at that point yet. Give them time. Look, just keep your head on straight. Same deal. All shot to pieces. Hope this isn't anyone you know. No. Good. Damn. Damn it. More on that side. You check out these ones. See if there's anything on them that'll tell us who they were. Dude, what if, uh, Christina, or what's her name? Christina, I think? 
fucking wrecked all these dudes. That'd be crazy. Krista, the woman I was with, what happened to her? Please, tell me, tell me! <coughs> Please. Fine. Just just lost my footing. Damn it. God damn it. Burgers. Yeah, bit. I'm out of ammo. Come this way. Bitch. Damn it. You get your asses over here, both of I'll you. I'll cover you. We got to get out of here. Get over here, god damn it. Can't you listen to me once? Come on. Other one's gonna die. Nick! Hold on! Nick! God damn it! Nick! We have to go! Did he get bit? I don't even know. I think he did. Next time on The Walking Dead. Alright, that's the end of this one. Let's see what, what happens. What are you gonna do? Someone's outside. Someone came here looking for you. A man. What? Did he say what his name was? We know damn well who it was. Who is he? One of the guys we were with before. What's he gonna do? Can't keep going. I figure we got about four, five more days to reach those mountains. We ain't here to rob nobody. Just relax and put the gun down, man. I thought you were dead. Was that that one guy from the first episode ever who left? Hell yeah, man. Alright, let's see. Alright. Let's see what uh I did. Okay. You and ninety two percent of other players uh stopped to help Krista. Alright. Um you and ninety well almost ninety one percent killed the dog. Did you give water to the dying man? Yes I did. Accepted Nick's apology. Um no, I didn't. Did you save Nick or Pete? Probably most of the people um, saved Nick because Pete was already bitten. But I, don't know, I probably should have done the same. That probably would have probably would have been a smarter move. But I, I like I literally I watched him get bit and then it completely spaced out of my mind. I was like, oh, Pete's cooler, so I'm gonna save him. But whatever. All right. Uh. There's that. I think that's 
I think that's it. So. Alright, yeah, that's it. Alright, guys, thanks for watching these episodes, or these parts of episode 1 of season 2 of The Walking Dead. Remember, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like rating below if you want to see videos whenever I release them. Make sure to hit the subscribe button, and whenever I upload videos, they'll go straight into your subscription box. I'll see you later, guys. I'm SC Ambition. Feel that you should run But where are you to hide In the water Oh Against the tide of struggle the Skin wearing, skin wearing Against the tide of struggle To keep our heads above the deep the hearts above the line, above the line. We vow your life and blood. This is not our home in water. Oh, yeah, I hope he is never found. Just try and keep your way. Water. Oh, against the tide of struggle, the skin wearing, skin wearing, against the tide of struggle to keep our heads above the tea, and our hearts above the light. Never make amends for what we've done. Tainted blood. In his eyes, his eyes are full of love. Forgive them, release them. Against the tide of struggle, the skin wearing, skin wearing. Against the tide of struggle, to keep our heads above the deep, and our hearts above the.